Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of Love for Haitian Food and Other Foods. Like most people, I like to eat in general. So I wanted to show you guys other foods that I eat. And I thought, why not start with breakfast? So I'm gonna show you how I make coconut French toast. I first made this recipe back in 2015 for a friend's birthday and it was delicious. So if you wanna see how I make it, stay tuned. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please like, share this video, and subscribe to my channel if you like what you see here. Guys, please remember that all recipes can be found on my website, loveforhaitianfood.com. With that being said, let's get to the video. To make this, you will need stale French brioche bread, eggs, coconut flakes, coconut milk, vanilla extract, coconut extract, ground nutmeg, and cinnamon. And you'll also need some butter to fry the French toast in. So first thing I'm going to do is crack my eggs. The first thing we're gonna do is make the French toast batter. I'm gonna whisk my eggs together. And the next thing I'm gonna do is add my milk. Add vanilla extract, add coconut extract, and whisk. So being that the bread is so thick and big, I'm gonna use a baking dish to soak the bread in the batter. And then I'm gonna use a smaller baking dish to um, put the coconut flakes on it. Pour coconut flakes into baking dish. So the bread is pretty stale. I mean, the bread is stale, but not stale, stale. I should have left it out longer. It's been out for some hours now. But anyway, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna dredge in here and then put it in there, put it back on the plate. Let's just put all of them in there. Oh yeah, I could do five, maybe even six. I'm making sure that all of the sides of the bread get coated with the batter. Let it sit in there so it can soak it up. Let's take this 
it has been soaking really long. Now I'm gonna fry my French toast in butter. <laughs> I'm gonna use about a tablespoon of butter to start with. And you know, I'm gonna add more after cause butter is delicious. Not healthy for you, but delicious. let them fry for about a minute on each side maybe more let it fry until it's golden brown on each side oh that's pretty oh that's pretty This one over. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. Add some more butter in there. After I'm done frying them, I put them in the oven on a cookie sheet so they can stay warm. I'm gonna let them fry for a minute to two minutes on each side until they're golden brown. Fork. A little more syrup. I got drive. 
ready. The pineapple and the coconut, oh my God, such a good combination. I hope you try and like this recipe. It's really good. Thank you for watching. Bye. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. Subscribe to my channel and watch some of my previous videos while you're here. Thank you.